Good morning. Uh, Lorenda Carr here for Bathroom Tarot. Um, so, for all like five of you that might watch this, let's see what Spirit has to say. Um, yesterday was crazy accurate on my end. I wasn't quite sure where that was going when the when the card came up, the Page of Wands reverse came up, but um, yeah, it was it was so on point, at least for me. Um, I'd love to know um, as you watch these. Please feel free to leave a message. Let me know that someone's watching them more than just like five seconds of them. Um, would love to know your thoughts and and if there's ever anything that you guys would want me to ask or talk about, I'd love to know that as well. Let's see what Spirit has in store for us today. I fill up my whiteboard of things I have to do, so hopefully Spirit's going to be kind. Ah, okay, so the Knight of Swords. <clears throat> Knight of Swords. So the Knight of Swords is something coming and going very quickly. So a knight is an adventurer. Swords cuts things away. They're like, yeah, let's clear the path. Da, 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 da. Where sometimes conflict with, there's conflict with swords occasionally, um, but it's necessary conflict. And so you see the guy's going in charge. Yeah, he's, uh, he's feeling it. He's moving and he's ready to take on the world and like just cut, cut to the chase. So um, if there's something that comes in your direction today, just know that spirit's on top of that and it'll come and go just, it'll, it'll go just as quickly as it comes in. But also don't be afraid to be the one to go in and go, you know, I'm gonna take. I'm gonna handle this. You don't. Don't be afraid to be the knight on the horse. Let's see what the celebrate deck has to say to confirm growth. Okay, so the growth card. Um, so when we cut things away, it leaves room. Kind of like when you when you prune a bush or when um, you you know prune flowers. Cut the dead stuff off. It's not working for you it can create more growth. It makes room for growth. Um, and when, once you take the life-sucking entities out of your life, then the, <clears throat> the, the living parts of you, the part that, parts that need to grow, will continue to do so. So, um, if, perfect example of, of how, what I would see this as is, okay, so you've got that, that person that you're just not quite sure what, you know, maybe a conflictual person, or maybe someone has sent you a hateful text message. you got a choice, you, and you quickly, <clears throat> quickly can handle it. Um, and, and keep your cool head about you, though. Don't, the swords are also cool heads. They're not, they're not fiery like some of us, like wands. Um, be, be open to, yes, I'm going to cut this to the quick and, and get rid of it quickly, but how can I grow from it? Um, what can I do? We cannot, and I cannot stress this enough, we cannot control other people's actions, but we certainly can control our own reactions. And when something comes in quickly, we are faced with a choice when a conflict comes in and we can choose to wallow in it, we can choose to be angry, we can choose to be petty, we can choose to act like toddlers, or we can do the right thing and grow from it. So, if these are just as accurate as yesterday's, I've got a heck of a day coming. So, note to self, don't be blocking anybody right away. So, <laughs> all right. Thank you all. Have a wonderful day. And not sure I'll be around this weekend. I may not be. So, maybe I'll see you on Monday. Bye.